dear students welcome to ace academy and ace online platform this video brings you the job notification from securities and exchange board of india to access that type the url as www.sebi.gov.in and in that switch on to the careers you you'll find the detailed notification so the notification is regarding the recruitment of officer grade a as assistant manager for 20 year 2025 into the streams like general stream legal stream information technology stream research stream official language stream electrical engineering stream civil engineering stream so important dates to remember that is online application starts on 30th of october and it closes by 28th of uh, november 2025 so availability of call letters on sebi will be intimated by either by email or sms and the phase 1 of online examination will be on 10th of january 2026 and phase of phase 2 of online exam that will be on 21st of february 2026 and phase 3 that is interview those dates will be uh, intimated and here the candidates applying for general stream under unreserved category there are 23 vacancies vacancies for obc 14 vacancies sc it is 10 st it is 4 ews it is 5 and total number of vacancies offered is 56 okay and there are vacancies even included for pwbd candidates and the candidates who are applying for general stream are required to have master's degree or that is post graduate diploma with minimum 2 years of duration in any discipline and bachelor's degree in law or bachelor's in engineering or chartered accountancy okay are eligible to apply for this bachelor of engineering they have mentioned but not specifically which stream that has not been mentioned okay so for legal there are total 20 vacancies and anybody who is applying for information technology are required to have the bachelor's degree in computer science or computer application or information technology and the total number of vacancies are 22 vacancy breakdown based on the reservation is given so kindly go through it and candidates who are applying for the research stream the total number of vacancies are 4 and the candidates are required to have the bachelor's degree in the quantitative techniques international finance project and infrastructure and or else they should be having the degree in mathematics statistics informatics artificial intelligence machine learning big data, big data analytics so all these specializations are included so kindly go through them thoroughly before you apply so for official language there are three vacancies in uh, engineering electrical there are two vacancies the candidate is required to have the bachelor's degree in electrical engineering and along with that the work experience or desirable experience in the cctv surveillance system and addressable security alarm fire alarm and all the uh, job description details uh, regarding the lifts pumps and air conditioning plants are also given so kindly go through it and the candidates applying for civil engineering stream the number of total number of vacancies is 3 and the candidate is required to have the experience in the maintenance of office residential properties and colonies and the knowledge of pert and cpm techniques okay so the other uh, relevant specialization are also there so kindly go through it next uh, the yeah the age limit is not to exceed 30 years as of 30th of september 2025 so the candidate must be born on or after october 1st 1995 so upper age is relax uh, upper age limit prescribed above will be relaxable so minimum of 5 years for the candidates belonging to sc and st and up to 3 years for obc candidates okay so there is one more uh, point mention about the ncl that is non creamy layer so kindly go through that as well relaxation of 10 years for pwbd candidates and for even for ex servicemen it is also given so mode of 
selection. So mode of selection shall be in three stages as mentioned. So it is going to consist of phase one, phase two and phase three. So phase one is online screening examination which is going to consist of two papers of 100 marks and phase two is online examination consisting of two papers of 100 marks each and phase three is an interview. So for phase one, the exam, the paper one is going to include multiple choice questions on the general awareness fin relating to financial sector and uh, with difficulty that is that is between ranging from easy to moderate, English language proficiency, quantitative aptitude, test and reasoning will be there in the paper one. Okay, so the duration for paper one is 60 minutes and cutoff is 30%. And for paper two, the general stream, it is going to have multiple choice question on the subjects of commerce, accountancy, management, finance, costing, and companies act and economics. Okay, so the time duration for the paper two is 40 minutes and the cutoff is 40%. And there shall be a negative marking that's one fourth of the marks for the paper one and paper two in the phase one. And there shall be minimum cutoff of 30% of paper, the minimum cutoff of 30% for the paper one and cutoff of 40% for the paper two. And phase two is going, phase two is an online examination which is going to include that is uh, three, that is going to include the contents will be in G English that is descriptive test to test the drafting skills. Next is multiple choice questions on commerce, accountancy, management and there is a paper two which is going to have legal stream, information technology is there, research stream is there, official language is there. So based on the area what you select the time duration and the cutoff is given. So kindly go through these details thoroughly. Okay, so these are the uh, instructions regarding once you clear off stay phase one and phase two. So uh, what will be the further uh, communications given by SEBI? So those are the guidelines, kindly go through it. And the shortlisted uh, listed candidates will be called for an interview and the interview will have a weightage of 75 marks and the relevant post qualification experiment experience will have 25% of the weightage. So probation that is the successful recruitment of the candidate for the post of officer grade A shall be undergoing uh, into a probation of two years and after that your service will be confirmed. The pay scale offered is between 62,500 to 1,26,100. The list of benefits are given so kindly go through it. So the examination centers, the list of cities where the examination centers are available is given. So kindly go through the list thoroughly. And phase two examination will be held in the following city. So these are the list of cities for the phase two examination. The application fee for OBC EWS is 1000 rupees plus 18% of GST and for SEST and PWBD it is 100 rupees as intimation charges with 18% of GST. So details regarding the PWBD candidates are given so kindly go through this. Guidelines for the PWBD candidates and the pre-examination training for SCST and OBC PWD candidates. Kindly go through the list of instructions, general instructions are given. So application process, how it has to be done, the guidelines and details, uh, the documents which is to be uploaded are mentioned. So kindly go through the list. Yeah, so here is how the application process starts is given. So see the, see where you can access the web uh, notification and start the application process. Payment of fee is done through the online mode and guidelines to upload the photograph signature, left hand thumb impression and handwritten declaration and specifications of photograph, 
photo capture all these have been mentioned clearly so kindly go through these so regarding the selection select call letters for the selected candidates so they can download it from the official website list of uh, the send in instructions for candidate visiting the center is given and identity verification will also be done yeah syllabus for phase 1 and phase 2 is given so this is the syllabus those who are applying for engineering and non engineering streams go through it thoroughly so it's a 31 page notification and it is also having some annexures regarding the dicksum declarations so read these declarations thoroughly and for more updates on job notifications and higher education hit the subscribe button thank you and all the best